and what are the surgical steps uh, for the layman uh, or for the primary care physicians out there what are the basic steps of neuromodulation any candidate who we consider for uh, neuromodulation first we evaluate with them a basic ultrasound urodynamic test we rule out the infection and then we ask them to maintain a bladder diary at least for three days so that we get to know how severe is their symptoms and this will also helpful in assessing the response to the treatment once we have finalized the candidate we do a test uh, electrode implantation it will be put in the sacral area that is the lower back area under the x-ray guidance we identify the sacral nerve s3 nerve and then put in a small wire there there will be about uh, hardly about half a centimeter cut and we make a small space for the battery to be kept if at all next it is required and then we send the patients home usually the procedure takes about one hour and the same day they can go home and after the procedure they again they maintain the bladder diary so that we get to know how much improvement is there and after the test phase lasts about two weeks after two weeks once they return to us we compare and once we decide that it is successful in these patients, these are the candidates for permanent implant. How heavy is the implant? It's hardly about uh, 20 grams. 